hacer un gol Yo daré la vida, la mi vida, que en fondo lo soy Será una partida infinita En sueños de hoy, en coro que sale a soñar, se ayuda a la noche, no mata a mi nutri, perseñar, en Oturri. Well, good evening to you wherever you are in the world. We are just about ready for the action here. Kickoff is imminent. The teams indeed with us very soon, having exchanged their various pleasantries. What I have to tell you is that the weather may not be great for the duration of the evening. The clouds are yet to open, but one suspects that they will pretty shortly. And when the rain comes, we are warned to expect plenty of it. It is a venue this which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. So Jim, who do you identify as the key man in this fixture? Yeah, Diego Godin. A strong, powerful centre-back who makes great use of his physical gifts. He's very strong in the air, but he also excels at, at reading the game and stepping in to make those crucial interceptions. More than anything, though, I think he's going to give this team a mental boost because everyone else knows that he's prepared to put his body on the line over and over. Yeah, I must agree, especially in view of his ability to lead and organise the defence. Well, if he did just miss it, we are up and running already. D'Ambrosio has given away a free kick. Rincon. D'Ambrosio gets it back. Cuts it out. Gagliardini. D'Ambrosio provides an outlet. He's got away. Up towards the front line. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. There's a long ball. Ball through needs to be good here. D'Ambrosio. Martinez. Martinez spreads it towards the left. Up to meet it! This could fall anywhere! Cleared without complication. Hits one! And it's a goal! Well, no goalkeeper would keep that out. It really was a bullet. That was just the top draw finish. He was always in control and couldn't have placed it any better. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. And it's Pelotti. Loose ball, who's going to get there? Forward it goes. Hoists it forward. 
He's made sure that that won't get through. Rincon. De Silvestri plays it forward. He's got through. Just the goal. It's Lukaku! Good run, lovely take, but that is where it stops. Lukaku did very well to get himself one on one. Now he's got to figure out how to beat the keeper. Rincon. Brozovic battles to win it back. Well weighted. Gets away from his opponent. Well read, he sorted that out. To Silvestri. Coming up to half time, leading, and things are looking pretty good. Looks to bypass the midfield. And he's straight offside. Stefan de Vrij. D'Ambrosio. And here's Lukaku. Is there any support? He might not need it. Well, that's where he wants it. Oh, good interception. Now it's Lukaku. Oh, good take and a good area. Oh, the ball's come loose. And the volley. He's beaten the keeper, but hit the post. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? The Half-time whistle goes. There we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, it shows glimpses of some wonderful football to groom at the lead at half-time, and that's definitely pleased the fans. I think they'll be looking to keep this intensity up now in the second half. Leading 1-0 at the break. And they are already promptly back on the way. 1-0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. They've been denied a chance to develop any rhythm in the passing department. Sidigu deals with it effortlessly. to get it forward quickly Ashley Young Brozovic Martinez that intervention was very necessary that's gone a long way up and away Kunu does well there, alert And it's played forward. The fry proves too strong there. And it's Lukaku. Lukaku gets it out to the wing. Gets up to head it! Attempt, just the wrong outcome. Uh, that's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then. And it's been taken straight back. Well, the ball's come loose and the chase is on.
to Silvestri. It's come loose. Now it's Lukaku. Lukaku plays it out to the flank. Lukaku with the clearance. Forward it goes. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. And it's D'Ambrosio. Has a goal! Oh, and that should have been two. Oh, and a real chance to pile on the pressure, and he'll be desperate to get another. So here comes the substitution. Ashley Young. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? Verdi. Torino are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. Just brushed off the ball there. Tries to get it forward quickly. And it's D'Ambrosio. D'Ambrosio takes control of it and he's on the move. And out to safety. Yeah, it's safe to say that they just need to manage this to secure the win now. That's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. <laughs> now it's Lukaku. He's left his man. It's a clear foul. The referee's got a decision to make. And the referee's decided that he was fouled outside the box, and it is just a free kick. No second thought, a straight red card. Torino are down to ten men. Well, it was deliberate, it was cynical, and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. So what can they conjure from this one? Looking to pull clear here. By a great piece of goalkeeping, absolutely. The referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. Terrific contest. It really might have tipped either way. The margins were tiny. Just a goal.